it's Ann Feldman from the Bellevue Public Schools Instructional Technology Team and today I am going to share with you how to embed your Google presentation into a Schoology page. So to start off with start in your Google slideshow and then go over here to file and go down to where it says publish to the web. Then notice you have the embed tab right here. It's kind of gray and then boom it comes to life when you hover over it. Here you can also set the slide size and you can also auto advance slides. Then if you love how that looks you just come down here and highlight and copy this embed code. So that is step one. Copy that embed code. Next you're going to go over to Schoology and you go into your course. Then under add materials Go down here to where it says add page and add a page. Now the page feature allows you to add a number of other things. So one of those things, if we come across the top all the way to the end, it says switch to HTML. So go ahead and click and then paste in that embed code and click on create. I'm going to give it a title and call this Sample Slideshow and say Create. Now what it will do is it will embed that slideshow right here. So let's take a look. If I click, there is the slideshow and now your students can control that movement forward and back through that slideshow. Now I do want to show you one other feature, so I'm going to go back again into the course and into that page. So let's go over here and edit the page. Now when this loads up, down below under options, you have different options at the bottom. So as you hover over them, we'll notice this one says display on a new page or display in line. So let's take a look at what display in line looks like. Now notice Students don't have to click to get into the slideshow. Instead, it's in line here with that item, so now they can see it and work on it here. The fantastic piece is the students don't have to click to get into the slideshow. It saves them a click. Now on the other side, it does start to fill up your stream of content. So. There's pluses and minuses to the inline feature, but I think it's definitely one to take a look at because if you're teaching lower elementary, this would be fantastic for them. So it's just right here, that toggle, display inline, or display on a new page. And again, once you make that change, you'll need to save those changes. So what I shared with you in this presentation then is how you can start in your Google slide. You can go under File and Publish to the Web copy that embed code, jump over to Schoology, add it as a material, as a page, and then make sure to go to the very end, switch to HTML, paste in that code, and create. That's all there is to embedding your Google Slideshows into your Schoology. Thanks for watching this presentation.